Hey guys, let's do one of these limits at infinity. It's the limit as x approaches infinity of this polynomial divided by this polynomial. We can't ever actually look at x equals infinity, but we can find the limit as x approaches infinity. First, if we use direct substitution and just plug infinity in for all the x's, this will give us infinity over infinity, which doesn't really tell us anything. So in order to get the actual value, we're going to have to get creative. We're going to divide everything by the highest degree x. So we're going to divide top and bottom of this by x squared. And then we can and distribute that divided by x squared to each of the terms so it ends up looking like this. And now let's simplify this. The 6x squared over x squared, the x squareds will cancel each other out to just give us 6. And then 2x over x squared, we can reduce the top and bottom by a single x to give us 2 over x. And then 5 over x squared will just leave us 5 over x squared. And same thing down here, these will cancel to give us 2, and this will become 3 over x. So now we're ready to put the infinity in. And there's a fun way to visualize this. You can imagine literally plugging in infinity in for each of the x's. And just what would two divided by infinity be? If you had two and you cut it into infinity pieces, it ends up being zero. And this one would really be zero when you're divided by infinity squared. And then these last two will also be zero. And this will simplify to six over two, which is equal to three. So the limit of this polynomial over this polynomial as x approaches infinity is gonna be equal to three. And if we were to look at this on a graph, this is where the horizontal asymptote would be. As x gets very large, this is a graph would approach three, but never hit it. How exciting.